surfing cold water is a lot different to surfing warm water. It just hits harder. Cold water will actually restrict your breathing a bit, so when you get smashed by a big wave, you'll run out of oxygen. It's a serious physical, mental, emotional challenge. It's a, it's a test. There's nothing like the Cold Water Classic series in professional surfing. The whole concept of it is sort of completely different to regular WQS events, which are held in small waves and uh, sort of summer conditions, and we always end up with tiny little waves to surf. It frustrates a lot of the guys on tour when we're chasing the sun and we've got tiny waves. Like, I'd rather it raining and onshore and eight foot than one foot and sunny. around chasing winter everywhere, we're going to actually get waves for every event that we serve. The Cold Water Series being as mobile as it is is great because less structures built up in places which kind of can be a bit of an eyesore and it gives us the opportunity when we do get these big storms to come into pick up everything, move it around the corner, you know, to a more sheltered location with better quality waves. It gives the competition an edge to, it'll test the surfers in different kinds of waves. It'll be guys that are, are well-rounded surfers. They're the ones that are gonna win.